right, so that was a Mario day. Okay, so Nintendo just casually announced that they and Illumination are back together once again to work on another film set in the world of Mario. They're already hard work at storyboarding and moving into animation very soon. And right now, it is set to release in April 2026. So, it's not really that far. They also just casually dropped release date for Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door Remake and Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. And that's all we got for Mario Day. Uh, back to the movie, which is the big one here. What's interesting is that they didn't outright say it's a sequel. They just said a new film based on the Mario series. It could be a Donkey Kong film, but I'm pretty sure they would have said it was a DK film, saying we are making a new film based on the Donkey Kong franchise. But then again, DK is in the world of Mario, and they did say they want to expand the world, and showing more of DK and his side of friends and enemies would be great. It could also be Luigi's Mansion, but it's hard to say right now. Uh, going back to them stating they want to expand on the world of Mario in the movie, so maybe that means that for uh, other species to show up, such as the Yoshis, and we know Yoshi's gonna show up because of the first movie's ending. Maybe more about the Lumas, uh, you know, going to have Luma Lee, possibly hinting at Rosalina, and um, uh, or even Sarasaland with Princess Daisy. Again, all hard to say, but I feel like Yoshi and Daisy are lost for the second Mario movie. I especially think Daisy is the lock for the movie, because literally the day of the new movie announcement, we got a leak of a storyboard panel, I'm not going to show it here, uh, of Mario and Luigi here's to be a shopping area that is located in a desert area because Mario and Luigi are wearing hoodies, similar to what you would wear in an area like that. And so since the Russellland is around a desert area, now you may think, oh, this is a fake thing. Uh, yeah, I thought so too. But then, the image was hidden a day later due to copyright. And this was on the same account that leaked the Sonic Movie 3 and Knuckles TV storyboards that were proven to be legit. So, yeah, it was real. At least we know that Mario and Luigi will be together and not separated this time. Also, the reason why I think Daisy is a big lock is because even more concept art for the first movie was shown. Showing a lot of different ideas for the movie, the story, and even the final battle. We even see that they were kind of going a little bad story on Bowser liking Peach in a high school setting where he got rejected. And we see characters like Daisy, even Mauser, Birdo, Chuck and Chuck. And in the final battle, we got a truckload of characters. Look who's riding Wiggler, Daisy. Also, Wigglers were caught, dang it. Also, it appears that Daisy actually has her long hairstyle. I believe that maybe she might have the long hair in the beginning and then cut her hair later to her normal design that we have now. I mean, if they were gonna go with that design in the second movie. We also see Toad riding a blue Yoshi, Toadsworth, King Boo, Peach with her Perry Parasol from Super Princess Peach. I mean, wow! A lot of stuff shown, and a lot of things are probably going to happen in the next movie. So, now we just wait, as they didn't tell us anything else, you know, since in two years. I expect maybe a teaser early next year, and then maybe a trailer later on. Maybe a cast announcement, you know, like maybe before the teaser. That's like they did before. Oh, I dread to see who's voicing Yoshi, oh my goodness. That's all the Mario news for today. How happy are you for another movie based on the Mario series? And what do you hope it will have? Let me know what you think. I'll see you all later.